Hello everyone. Today we'll go over the product tab. In this tab, we can add product article number, fill in the required fields, and the information that you need. Click on Save. We can also delete an article. Adjust the position of the default article. This button here below enables us to edit product data. For example, supplier information. We can update supplier name, their email address or contact details. When we are done updating product information, we can click on Save. In the field of Tags, we can add a tag to this technical file. This allows us to easily search for specific tags. We can also change the workflow status of this file. For example, when a document request has not been accepted by the supplier, we can change the file's workflow status to Action Needed and assign it to the colleague responsible for this supplier. Click on Save. Then the colleague will receive an email from the platform as a reminder to follow up on this file. In Product Requirements Information, updates can be made. But kindly note that two parts are not free of charge. Namely, market release date and product category. Updating these two parts will incur additional charges. Regions, Q&A and Customers. For these three parts, updating them would be free of charge. When we have received product pictures, we can click on Set Product Image. Select a picture. Click on Save. Thanks everyone.